The third round of the Shell Houston Open is in the books, and for the third time, the lead has changed hands. After 18, it was Scott Piercy. After 36, rookie Andrew Putnam. And after 54 holes, it's Jordan Spieth who is looking to become the second player with multiple wins so far this season. Spieth kicked it off early with a birdie on the first, and then drained this long one on the sixth. Hello. 15 to 20 feet. There aren't many people out here better than he is. And there also aren't many better than from 40 feet out. This is not going to be short. <laughs> I guess not. <laughs> oh, Jordan Spieth all of a sudden to 14 under par. Spieth may have brought the fans to their feet, but it was Patrick Reed who had them nearly jumping out of their shoes. Check this out. Patrick Reed, par 316 from 188 yards. How about an ace for Patrick Reed? And he was not done yet. The Tournament of Champions winner then raced his caddy to the green, despite battling a knee that's been bothering him. And then, just in case everyone wasn't entertained enough, well, he then capped it off with a chip in on the third. Boy, his short game has been on display this week. Kyle Reifer started out his round right, holing out for Eagle on the 10th. No, are you kidding? Yes, he did. Good way to start the round for Rifers. While well, Gonzalo Fernandez Castaño made it happen on the 17. That'll put a smile on your face. And the Big Easy always puts a smile on our faces, especially when he's showing us just how simple this game can be. He just makes it look easy. One of the best stories this week comes from 24-year-old Austin Cook. He's a Monday qualifier who and just his second PGA Tour start has played himself not only into the weekend, but into contention. He made this chip in on the seventh, and he enters Sunday just one off the lead. So Spieth leads by one at 14 under par, and with 18 holes to play, there are plenty of players fighting right behind him in an effort to punch that last ticket to Augusta. Enjoy Championship Sunday, and I will see you on Monday for Trending on Tour.